Clay Sims, uh, former University of Alabama athlete. Uh, recently, I have been released from the Falcons, and right now, since then, I have been working on my endurance, my muscle mass, uh, been cutting down fat, been my endurance is a lot better, and um, I'm more focused than I was last time. My IQ to the running back position has gotten better. I've been working hard on it Monday through Friday, and I've been staying in watching film. I mean, we've been uh, training Blake for about a month now, uh, just really focusing on his nutrition in order for, you know, for him to hit, hit that peak performance, uh, maximize his workouts, maximize his endurance, and also be more explosive. You know, we done been through a lot of different trainers, and you know, everybody got their own little thing, but it just, it was different when he came here. You know, he was, it was the thing that you uh, was starting to teach him to do as far as outside this place is what really made the difference. Uh, the kid could play. He, uh, he's been humble, and uh, he's ready to work. Um, he came in the other day in, in the weight room, and uh, you could tell this look about him, and he's like, man, I'm frustrated, I'm mad. Uh, I was watching this game yesterday, and uh, there's just a lot of guys don't have what I have, you know. So whenever you hear a guy, you know, watching film and getting frustrated just because, you know, he doesn't feel like some guys could compete at his level, that's, that's something big. Well, he, he always had a good mindset. It, it's just that he didn't have a proper teacher. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's what, that's what happened this time around. He we ran into y'all, and, and you were able to teach him what to do. Okay. He's going to do exactly what he's supposed to do, but he didn't know. We, I didn't know. I feed him soul food all the time, you know, <laughs> so I just didn't know. We didn't know the proper way to diet him and what he should be putting in his body. Definitely going to see a new version of him. I mean, his endurance, um, the workouts. I mean, he's been consistent. Uh, nutrition is big, so, I mean, just, um, you know, give him another chance and, you know, you'll see what happens. What gets me to go get up and keep going at it and the reason I haven't quit is my wife. You know, my family, you know, the love of the game. The excitement of the game, being with, in the locker room, being with your t fellow teammates, you know, and then being able just to put that jersey on, you know, and uh, God keeps the faith in me. You know, my father keep the faith in me and just wanted to be the best. You know, I always want to be the best my whole life, and I feel like I'm not done yet.